So one thing I forgot to do, and I do it frequently, is uh, setting output uh, flags on the pins that are outputs. Uh, one place that I didn't do it was on the uh, PC load control. I'm not sure if you saw or realized these lines were blue, and uh, you know that meant that there was a pin that wasn't being driven, and, which of course was the output pin of the PC load control sub sub circuit. So I fixed that. And then I didn't set the output of all of the output pins on the CPU. So uh, that, would, that would definitely cause problems. So I'm going to go do that. What I think I want to do is uh, simply stick, stick the CPU on here and just hardwire it up with some, with some user interface components and Without hooking any memory up to it at all, uh, I really just want to tick it because I, you know, I think um, if we think about for a minute what is what's supposed to happen if we put nothing in the inputs and tick the clock and and drive reset low, what should happen out here on the output? What I think should happen is nothing memory should be low the output to memory should be low the write signal should remain low uh the address remain at zero and the program counter though should increment every time the clock ticks that's what i think should happen so question is does it happen well let's find out Let's just uh, see, can we just tick the program counter? Oh, we can tick the program counter. Look at that. So we tick the program counter and, or actually, sorry, tick the clock and the program counter counts. Yeah, it counts up as we expect. Okay, well, that's promising. That's that's what I would expect it to do, and everything else stays off. Uh, okay, well let's uh, let's progressively um, just do a little more testing. So let's take the reset. And let's see if we can put the CPU in reset. Okay, so if I keep ticking now. Uh, Simulate. So if I keep ticking, it keeps counting. Now, if I put the CPU in reset, and then I tick again, boom, it's uh, program counters back to zero, which is what I would expect. And if you keep ticking, when the CPU is in reset, it should just stay at zero. Okay, so if I take the CPU out of reset, then it should start counting up again. Okay, so it looks like the reset circuit doing what we expect it to do.